morning, folks. Welcome back. It is not a bad morning outside in the mid 40s out there for many of us to low 50s now across the south. 41 in Clinton, a little chillier there. 43 Lake Ozark. Meanwhile, 45 in Springfield with a 52 down in Harrison, Arkansas and Mountain Home. Winds pretty calm right now, but maybe just a light breeze from the north, maybe five miles an hour. And that'll be just about it. That'll be the case in the daytime today as well. Winds on the lighter side of things. Now there is some cloud cover and some rain showers now getting into southeastern Kansas weakening as they move this direction. All right, we have that again, a north wind right now. We're expecting the wind to turn more of an easterly wind. East winds tend to squash any kind of rain chances out there, but uh, for the morning hours, maybe some sprinkles lasting into western Missouri, but uh, generally going to be staying dry for today as that activity wraps on up. Here it is now. You can see it's already weakened a little bit across Kansas and Oklahoma. We'll see those clouds, though, come on in for today. So the next 12 hours, overall, not a bad day today. Low 70s for a high temperature later this afternoon. Maybe a little chilly out there with the cloud cover in place at times. Not all day, just at times the cloud cover will be there. And winds again out of the north and east. So it might feel a little cooler today, but still pretty mild. Okay, low 70s. Can't complain too much about that. We're staying dry today, too, for the most part. So no real concerns there with rain showers. Here's those clouds coming in at times. Some gaps in between, though. We'll see some sun out there mixed in as well. If we go into tonight, we'll see the rain shower chances increase. Okay, a warm front comes on through the area as we go into tonight and tomorrow morning. Spotty showers and maybe some thunder and lightning associated with a few of these areas for tomorrow morning but it will be kind of spotty for tomorrow morning. As we go to the daytime on Thursday, a larger wave of rain and yes, a few thunderstorms non severe will come on in to southwestern Missouri, northwestern Arkansas. Heavy rain possible there. Central Missouri, lighter rain, but still looking at some rainfall potential there for tomorrow. It will be a rainy day, bottom line, on your Thursday. How much rain we talk about? Some places could see an inch, some places could see two to three inches and places off towards central Missouri and west central Missouri down to the south and east, maybe half inch or less for folks near Rolla up to Lake Ozark and off towards uh, Nevada. Going into Friday, there's going to be a risk for severe weather. It's a slight risk right now, a two out of five risk, and that's just going to be a couple storms Okay, in the area. We could see strong to severe weather there. A couple things to watch out for, though, that could change the impacts we see for the afternoon is that we could see some morning thunderstorms for Friday morning. What happens in the morning will impact what happens in the afternoon. All right, so it just kind of depends on where we what we see in the morning. If there's a lot of storms in the morning, eh, we may not see so much in the afternoon. If there's not that much in the morning, we may be focused more on the afternoon. So just uh, kind of a day by day uh, pattern coming up. But storms likely in Kansas, those will move to the east as they do. We'll see again some strong to possibly severe weather coming away for Friday. As we go into the weekend, Saturday has a storm risk with it down there to the southwest. Those storms could also make it to the north and east and Sunday. The uh, risk moves farther eastward and more severe weather possible for both Saturday and Sunday. Low 70s for today, low 50s overnight tonight. Rainy day for Thursday. We have the umbrella handy for, for wet weather. Friday storms and Saturday storms and again on Sunday. Tracking severe weather for Friday and Saturday and Sunday. Guys. Well, lots to look at there, Tom. Thanks.